Welcome back everybody, my name is Brendan Dickinson and today we're answering the question, what is Unity? This is an update to a video that I did seven years ago and also the first video in a series of shorter videos talking about different aspects of Unity, such as its future, its history, how it's being used outside of games, and much more. So what is Unity? Unity is a real-time 3D and 2D cross-platform game engine developed by Unity Technologies and first released in 2005. I know that sounds like a lot, so let's break it down. So what do I mean by real-time? Real-time means that the graphics are being updated so quickly on the video card that there is no noticeable delay experienced by the user. Contrast this to certain pre-rendered content like 3D animation and movies where things are being rendered on a different computer ahead of time and then played back as video or cutscenes. They're things that you can watch play out and they're usually much higher quality, but they're not things you can interact with at all. And nowadays, real-time content is getting very close to the quality of pre-rendered content. So when we talk about Unity being real-time, that means you can change things on the fly and interact with your game while it's playing in the editor. 3D and 2D just means that Unity supports the development of both three-dimensional and two-dimensional games, and they have lots of tools that are specific to both of those. Cross-platform means that it runs on multiple platforms. As of right now, Unity will run on macOS, Windows, and Linux. And if you're watching this video, you might be asking, what's a game engine? Well, a game engine is a tool that helps game developers create games. It handles several aspects of the game so that developers can focus on things like mechanics, game design, and making it fun instead of reinventing the wheel and starting from scratch. It provides many built-in features such as physics, 3D rendering, and collision detection. This is especially true for indie developers and hobbyists, and by using a game engine, you can save yourself years of effort in development because of the tools they offer. Unity is powerful, extremely easy to use, and free until you start making a decent amount of money. While game engines do provide you with a lot of tools, you'll still have to do some kind of scripting with them, whether that's through written code or visual scripting. When it comes to coding, Unity uses the c -sharp language. This is one of the easier languages to learn as, and is very close in syntax to Java. You'll also need a coding editor, or IDE, to work alongside of Unity. Most people use Visual Studio, and for people who are just starting, VS Code or Visual Studio Community are great options. I personally use JetBrains Rider and would recommend that for people that are a bit more experienced. Links to those in the description below. Unity can be used to build for many different platforms and is a much easier way to handle multi-platform games instead of porting them to each platform yourself. So who should use Unity? Well, in my opinion, indie game developers or hobbyists, as well as businesses that are interested in creating an immersive real-time experience, such as a simulation or training exercise, whether it be on desktop, mobile, or VR, AR. The engine has been adopted by many industries outside of gaming, such as film, automotive, architecture, engineering, construction, and even the United States Armed Forces. I'll probably make an updated video on how to install Unity, including how to use the Unity Hub. There are many different resources that Unity provides to help creators, and here are a few. Unity Learn is a great place to start if you're trying to get into learning Unity. Unity also has an asset store, which I've talked about a lot in my other videos, but basically you can find almost anything you'd need for your game on the store, whether it's animated models, materials and shaders, a scripting library, you can even get full games and demos on the store to pick apart in Unity. Unity Answers is also available and usually has good information if you're stuck on a problem or have a question about the engine or API. Unity is not the only game engine out there and it definitely has pros and cons to using it just like any other game engine. If you'd like more information, check out my Unity vs Unreal video where I do a deep dive into each engine and why you might want to use one over the other. Hopefully you have a much better understanding of what Unity is. If you have any additional questions, please leave them below in a comment. I'd be happy to answer them. If you'd like to see shorter, more focused content like this in the future, please go ahead, leave a like, subscribe to see more, have fun creating, and I'll see you next time.